Rugrats, I need your help. So I'm going to play a clip right now on the screen of this bird that keeps flying into our window. So that bird has been flying into our garage window for the past two months and we have no reasoning to it. We have no idea why it does that and I searched it up of course. Why do birds fly into windows and yeah, I probably shouldn't have searched that up. So one, it says that it could be a sign of death which I hope that that's not the case at all. Another thing that I read and I actually know about this is that if a bird flies into a window is because there's spirits or demons in that person's home. And I'm sure if you guys have watched scary movies, there are some movies where birds fly into the windows. If you follow me on social media, you probably saw that I post on Snapchat and Instagram like almost every other day, this bird flying into the window. And a lot of people have been telling me maybe there's like a bird's nest in my garage and the bird is trying to get in. Of course, if you fly into the window one, and you notice that it's glass you're not gonna do it again but this bird consistently just does it at least five times a day for like 30 minutes it's so weird so I really need your guys's help to get to the bottom of this I mean I wish I could just ask the bird like hey what's up why do you keep flying into our window but we can't do that so I'm gonna need your guys's help and let me know what you guys think this is I kind of put the blame on myself if it's the whole demon situation because in the past I've played the Ouija board inside this house and that is probably the stupidest thing I've ever done in my whole entire life and I never encourage anyone to play the Ouija board if you have the opportunity to do it don't do it please I was actually gonna make a separate video about this but I might as well just mention it now almost every night I have nightmares and every morning I wake up with scratches on my body and I always want to tell myself that it's me scratching myself in my sleep but the scratch marks like first off I don't have long nails and the scratch marks are so deep like I'm gonna put a picture up on the screen right here I took this picture this morning and I had like a fat scratch on my shoulder and I wake up with different scratches on my back, my arms, my legs. Anyways, what is going on guys? FaZe Rug here and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video and I hope you guys are all having a fantastic day as always and check out my beautiful Lamborghini right behind me. Yeah, this is what happens when you lose a challenge. So I'm gonna be taking this to the shop soon. A lot of people thought it was in the shop getting its new wrap, which I said it was, but we had it brought back to my house when I flew out the two fans to come to my house because I want to show them my Lambo and take them for rides. But it is going to be in the shop very soon and we already have the next wrap in mind. It is incredible, it's insane. You guys are not gonna guess what it is and it's gonna break the internet, that's all I'm gonna say. But guys, I have to show you something super gross that's happening in my car right now and I'm terrified because I hate spiders, but basically there's spider webs forming inside of my car. They're not from the outside, they're all from the inside. So I know damn well there's a spider in my car, maybe two, maybe three, Maybe 20 if it laid eggs. Okay, so I don't know if you could see this one right here And then there's one above the mirror right here I don't know if you could see it that clear and we can't forget about the best one in the car Look at this guys the spider webs are everywhere, and it's disgusting. I hate spiders so much look at that Imagine I'm driving and then a spider just comes down its web right in front of me like that's actually dangerous because I don't know What the hell I would do right now guys? I'm going to head over to my brother's house, and we're gonna go to the gym to play basketball I know crazy. I'm actually stepping out of my house whenever it's basketball season I always get in the mood to play basketball and I want to just bring you guys along with me throughout the day because I haven't really vlogged my days in a long time and you guys used to love when I vlogged every single day so this is kind of gonna be like an old school phase rug video so let's see how many likes we can get on this thank you guys for returning to my channel thank you guys for the continuous support let's get this bread guys does this house look familiar so my brother actually moved into our old house this is where I used to live obviously all the OG fans would remember that and give this video a thumbs up if you were watching me since I lived in this house my brother and Dennis were literally begging me to come to the gym with them today so I decided why not just get off my lazy ass you know it's Monday it's a new day it's the start of a new week it's time to get this bread time to stay healthy stay in shape grind day grind week grind month grind year grind life oh no oh no you are not who I wanted to see first are you shocked Brian, I'm so happy. I literally was about to call you like <laughs> right when <laughs> How's living in the old house? It's crazy. It feels so good. You don't understand, Brian. You Is it like the same or different? No, it's very different. Oh my god, this house. So much has happened here. Woo! All the OGs would remember this very that, room. I turned that into like a bathroom. Brandon. I'm just joking. I'm just joking. <laughs> oh my god, the phase logo. Oh, it does smell like piss in here though. That's him, not me. <laughs> 
Booker, this is my old room. Don't ruin it. Does anyone remember this vlogging setting right here? When I was a little kid, I was like, what's going on, guys? Faze rug here. <laughs> As if I still don't sound the same. <laughs> How many times I've jumped from this balcony, jumped off of there into a foam pit, trampolines in this house. Damn, this room. All the things you broke during Suns game, like. Oh, look. Look at the closet. <laughs> Guys, all this when the sons lose. Damn, this is crazy. When we did our father-son Chaldean show. It's oh so my crazy. god. The memories in this house are endless, literally. There's so many. I swear, but it's such a different feeling. Like, I'm no, used for to being sure. the kid in this house. It's so weird being like the You're, owner. you're the owner. It's so weird. You run this shit now. Like, imagine, you know, my dad used to- Oh my god. We used to shower in there. I swear, bro. Damn. So Brian and Dennis left to the gym first because I had to finish up my video really quick. Um, Brian, did you forget something at the house? You wonder how I'm vlogging with your camera? Because you forgot your camera at my house. But don't worry, I'll bring it to the gym for you. So I'll see you in like five minutes. Brian leaving to the gym before me shows basketball dedication. <laughs> He's serious about basketball today. Hey, now I believe we're related, Brian. I always thought we were half brothers, like step brothers. But now that I see how much you love basketball, it all makes sense. We really are related. We're really brothers. So Brian just texted me saying my camera, please, please. Brian, I got you. That better be my camera. Wait, what? <laughs> oh I'm vlogging. What you left? I'm just joking. This is yours. Okay, because I have like a black mark on the thing. Is you it? are that eager to go Ooh! play basketball? I missed you guys. It's nothing personal. I just I just yeah. forgot, okay? I was too excited to play basketball. All right, guys. We just won three games in a row, but then we just lost. I hate losing. I hate losing. Same here, but... I did pretty good. I actually did good. I don't know why I didn't set my camera down to show you guys some highlights, but I had a vouch. Brian did really good. I had a couple clutch threes. I'm sweating so bad right now, but you know, I think it was the merch that gave me the good luck. All 20% off. Don't forget rugwear.com. But I'm about to head out, Brandon. We're gonna part ways. I'm gonna stay for like a couple hours. Of course. Brian. What? <laughs> this is your camera. No. <laughs> yes. Wait, where's my camera? Brandon. Wait, was I vlogging with your camera the whole day? No, how do you know it's his Wait, camera? Because it has different, like you could just tell. See, Brian, that's yours. Look. No, mine has this line over no, here. Exactly. I, yeah, right there. I did that on purpose. Man. Oh, really? Wait, were you vlogging on this camera before too? I hope not. What? I don't know. Okay, well, guys, we are in Target. I wasn't planning on vlogging. Brian, I'm just kidding. Well, the funny thing is how you're vlogging here is I pulled the camera out because I thought it was mine. I was going to say, guys, the reason Brian's not vlogging in here is because he got banned for recording. So now here he is with his vlog camera recording. <laughs> so. Wait, here, you hold it then. What the hell? Uh, I've actually been banned for here only for recording we weren't messing around we weren't doing anything strictly for recording i came back next week and they kicked me out like i really am not supposed to be here right now i swear so do you since feel like a criminal this is such a crime recording in a store like, brian's in prison break he escaped i genuinely just don't get it but i'm gonna i'm gonna pull it off for you guys okay every time i vlog in my car something interrupts me the music starts playing but anyways guys i'm so excited to be doing this right now i have about nine piggy banks with me right now. We got $10,000 in cash. I just left the bank right now and we are about to go play a little game with my friends and family. Basically, I'm gonna have three piggy banks. One of them is gonna hold $10,000 and the other two are gonna have horrible, disgusting dares. Oh yeah, and I got this giant sledgehammer. By the way, my friends and family have no idea I'm coming over to their house. I'm literally just gonna show up with the piggy banks and I'm gonna ask them if they wanna play. There's a 33% chance you win $10,000. Who would ever deny that? But then there's also a 66% chance you will have to do a horrible dare and you won't win the $10,000. So we're gonna see who wants to play and who wins the $10,000. I swear $10,000 doesn't even look like a lot. Like, look at this. I mean, there's actually a lot of bills in here. So hopefully I get to make one of their days today. All right, guys, so we're having a little problem with the 10,000 fitting in the piggy bank. Nope, the rubber band's about to come off. Bingo, let's go. Dennis, you have a chance to win $10,000. Brennan, I'm sorry I didn't give you a chance for oh, this. Give me like 5,000. 5, uh, 5, Choose wisely. Two of these have horrible dares, and one of them has $10,000. 33% chance to win. 10 grand, bro. Stop, if I don't get the 10,000 right away, do I get one more chance or no? No, of one course not. No, yeah, no, you no. can't redo this. Three okay, Brandon, do you want to like help him or what? He gets a lifeline. This is some big money we're talking. Right, that one looks like he's winking at me more. Who? <laughs> that middle one. The middle? He's like, ah. It's never the middle. That's too obvious. I, too... I would choose left or right. I don't know. No, Wait, you're right. Hold on. Let me hold on. Let me tell my fans which one it's in. Oh, you know which one it's in? Like, yes. Okay. Oh, hold on. Can you guys turn? Actually, don't look. No, 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 I swear to God. Okay, don't look. 
Okay. Okay, Dennis. I'm saying either left or right. No, you're right about the middle thing. I'm going I'm, right. Brian, Brian's left-handed. That's all. I'm I mean, say. I want to see my friends win. Wait, Brian. Brian's left-handed. That's all I'm gonna yeah, say. Yeah, but he would do something like put it on the opposite. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know. Just smash one. Which emoji piggy bank can it be? I don't know. I say left, but don't listen to me. I don't want to ruin your chance. Ten thousand is a lot of money, bro. Wait, everyone, back up when he smashes yeah. it. Right or middle? Right or middle? I'm going right or middle. Not. Middle. Just do it, oh, no. everyone. Oh, what is it? You got a paper though. That means it's a dare. So here you go. I told you not middle. Eat dog food again. I've done this before and I almost threw up. <laughs> no way. Wait, so there's no way there can be money somewhere. The money is in the left. It's in the left. <laughs> Brandon, you called it. I was like, shh. How am I going to get the money out? Oh. Wait, no, 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 are you really gonna, is he really supposed to break it? To get the money out, I need it for the next contestant. Whoop! <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, oh my god. Oh. Damn, Dennis, I really wanted you to win this, though, low-key. For actually entering the game and playing, there's no. a hundred. Wow. And Brendan for watching. I'm okay, I'm okay, thank you, thank okay. you, thank you. Thank you, Dennis, congrats. You gotta eat the dog food, bro. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Booker, no, you have to share. You have to share, bro. There we go, Dennis, let's go. Dennis, no! Oh. Ah. Chew it! Uh. He's trying to get it. <laughs> eat it, eat it, eat it. Ew, let me see it, let me see it in your mouth. Ah. Ew! How is it? <laughs> okay, go ahead. You can spit it out, you can spit it out. Good game, good game, Dennis. You still got the hundred. Next contestant, guys, I'm going to my cousin's house, Jessica. And now she has a chance to win 9,900. Oh, Jessica. Remember how close we were growing up? You were always my favorite cousin. Like, if you win the 10,000. If not, I'm not. Whatever. Guys, everyone's laughing because I took the target basket. Are you not allowed to? Mom. Yes or no? No. You can't take the target it. basket with you. I have piggy banks, though. Like, they would break. So, but, like, you take them and you put them in your car and then and you then put the basket. And then when I drive and they hit the side of each other. <laughs> well, that's your responsibility, not targets. <laughs> I didn't know, okay? Like, I'm not a thief, guys. I promise. I'll return it after this video, but I didn't know. Don't you worry. I have a pair. Amanda has a <laughs> pair. <laughs> you know you're lucky contestant number two. So, I'm winning $10,000 is what you're talking about? I don't know. Dennis had to eat dog food because uh -huh. he didn't get the $10,000. Huh? I got two nice dares for you, too. You got a 66% chance of getting the dares and a 33% chance of winning this $10,000. You know, 33 is my lucky number today if you didn't know. Okay, guys. We got the three piggy banks set up right here. I'm not going to point to which one it has the money in, but it's the middle one. The middle one has it. All right, come on now. You are the next contestant. The next contestant on the prizes. Wrong. Your chance to win $10,000. Tell the whole world what you're gonna do with the money if you do win. <clears throat> do I lie or say the truth? <laughs> <laughs> say the truth. That is life changing. It is life changing. Do something for my parents, which I could do something small, like I could give them half of it. <laughs> and then the other half I could spend on like makeup. Maybe or like a down payment on a new car. I don't oh, know. Look at Brian thinking ahead. Me, uh -huh. I'm like, what can I buy? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Jessica, one of these has ten thousand dollars. Two of them have horrible dares, and you got to choose wisely. It's telling me it has ten thousand in it. Are you sure? Yeah, the butt of it is calling my name. All right, whenever you are ready, lightly hit it because maybe the table will break with it. Okay, ready? Smash that piggy bank. Okay, ready? Uh huh. I can't even hit it. One. Uh oh. Two. Oh, go. Oh my Wait. God, I don't see any money in there. Like, Wait, no, is there money in there? No, it obviously not. Hey, where's? Oh. Wait, where's the dare? <laughs> oh, it's right here. Okay, I was like, what? Jessica, if you want to open this and read it to the world, I don't know How which one bad it is. Are they? They're whatever. They're not extreme, extreme. They could be more extreme. Poor milk? Poor milk? Yeah, what does that mean? I'm going to take a gallon of milk and pour it all on your on head. Me? On your head. On me? <laughs> yup. You should have chose wisely, Jessica. The money was in the middle. Look at that. Oh my. I, in my head, I was like, there's no way he would actually put the money in the middle because like, that's too- That's exactly what Dennis and Brandon said. For competing, for contesting, you get $100. I'm putting a down payment on new <laughs> Jessica, oh, no. you should have just chose the right piggy bank. It's not that hard. Actually, I did choose the right one. Ah. <laughs> I'm so scared. You Are have you no ready? idea. I've never had this done before. Are you ready? Oh my God. Ah, Here we go. Three, can two. I get around? Ah! Oh. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Thanks for playing, Jessica. 
I'll see you. I'll see you uh, next time. All right, bye. Have a good day. I love you. I'll hug you later. I promise I'll come back to hug you. I gotta go. I gotta go. All right, bye. Wait, I forgot. I need to get the money for the next contestant. There it is. All right, guys, so I'm back home, and the third and last contestant for this game is my beautiful mother, and she's actually on her way home right now. She has no idea, actually. I didn't even tell her that I was doing this video or playing this game with anybody. I was planning on giving my mom money because lately she's been doing so much for me, and sometimes I'm just like surprising her with a nice little gift like that. So I'm gonna tell her there's gonna be two dares and one that has the 10,000. This has the 10,000 in there. The two dares on these papers are actually not dares. They're both just gonna say $10,000, and I'm gonna rig the game for her and just surprise her with the $10,000. So she's gonna think that she's gonna get a dare if she doesn't hit the pot with $10,000, but in reality, it's gonna be a nice little surprise for my beautiful mother, and this is gonna be a great surprise. I hope you guys are enjoying the vlog so far. Okay, mom, you want a chance to win $10,000, right? I mean, who wouldn't? Yeah, yeah, you know, I can use it. Of course I do. Okay, so I have three piggy banks, and I saved the teacup ones for you because I know you love tea. Mm -hmm. We got this big sledgehammer, and mom, one of these has ten thousand dollars cash Which one? two of them though have two bad dares like it's up to you if you want to play either you get a 33 percent chance to win the ten thousand or a 66 and you have to do this bad dare and i don't want to put you through the dare so it's up to you no I'll do it. whenever you are ready it's pretty heavy this thing right there it's pretty heavy okay so you mean eeny meeny miny mo or <laughs> Here we go, whenever you're ready, mom. Oh, oh my god. You got a dare. You got a dare, mom. What's the dare? 10,000? That's not 10,000 dare. There's all your money. I said I was gonna do the... That's all yours. You don't have to do any of the dares. That one wasn't the one with the money, of course, but even the middle one had a dare, but the dare was 10,000, so I want you to keep the money. No way. Yes, this is all yours. Wait, it's kind of windy, so you might want to grab it now. I'll grab it now because I want to grab it. Because but... <laughs> I was planning on giving you money, and I'm like, let me just do it in a creative way, you oh know? My God. Make you think you got a bad dare, but in reality, you win $10,000. That's do for this you. To me? You could split it with dad, too, if you want. I swear to God, in my mind, I was going to say that. Okay. Are you going to be home? Yeah. I'm going shopping. Okay, all right. <laughs> I'll see you later, mom. But anyways, guys, I hope you all did enjoy. Please smash that like button. Subscribe if you are new. And let me know if you guys like this style of vlogging. Uh, I kind of took it back to my old style. A lot of people enjoyed that. And who knows, guys, a Call of Duty video might be coming out soon. Oh, wow. Call of Duty video might be coming out soon. Subscribe if you are new. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Other than that, it's been Rug. Mama Rug. And we are out. Peace. Peace.